Hello everyone, I'm your host Aquaman, and welcome back to another episode of Mega Man 3. If you missed last episode, you probably shouldn't go watch it. I'm a little embarrassed about something that happened near the end. If you want the short version, Sparkman has been defeated, and we have encountered a new boss-type villain called Doc Robot, who has been using, so far at least, Robot Masters from Mega Man 2 to fight us. And when he used Quick Man against us, it was probably the hardest thing I have ever had to do in any video game, ever. I have, right now, done a bit of research on what to expect in the next stages because I do not want to have to go through, or at least be surprised by, something quite as terrible as I was on our last episode. Here's the password if you want to join me on this. Now we've got this on our screen. And after a little bit of research to figure out which one would be best for me to go to, it looks like the Sparkman stage we did last episode was in fact the worst one we could have ever possibly done no matter what. It is the hardest stage, the hardest boss in the game. At least to my interpretation of what I read so far, at least among these four. So, who are we going to go to see today? Well, I decided... Needleman seems to have the best weaknesses that I can exploit and is not quite as strong to a point as the previous one was. So, let's go to the Needleman stage. Yes, I have done a lot of research to figure out what's going to happen, so it may not seem blind, but I am just preparing. I am very prepared. Now, I understand that as a Mega Man game, there has to be some, uh, liberties taken with the design when they come to stuff like this. Can I make that jump? I don't think I can. But what I would really like to have seen is the entire stage redesign like this, but have no enemies all throughout. Doesn't that seem like it'd be more awesome? I mean, it'd be a lot easier, but the creepiness factor would certainly be there. That's new. Yeah! <laughs> oh, keep going. Okay. I would like that health refill if possible. That's fine. I don't know if I got a bonus for it. Okay. Oh, not this guy again. Uh, what do I want? What do I want? Let's do Magnet. Yeah, this is actually quite good. Haha! <laughs> and how am I going to... Oh. I think this is worth a Rush Jet. Can I go to the right? Nope, I can't. Okay. Going up. That's also worth a rush jet. Come on. Thank you. Actually, you know what I should be doing? Actually, yeah, I did pick up one life, I think. I thought I only had one life left, but... Yeah, whatever. So far, this stage seems to be rather easy. So far. Don't hold me to that. Oh well. Alright, first guy we're going to fight in here, let's see, is weak to the Magnet Missile and Spark Shock. Since I think that the Spark Shock sucks and so it does is paralyze enemies, I say we take in the Spark Shock. The magnet Missile would be much easier, but uh, yeah. Airman again. Come on, fire, fire, fire. I can, yeah. Let's see. Just get under the one. There. The thing about this enemy here is that in his airman section, he will still do eight points of damage to me, like he did in uh, Quick Man's level. But I got him. But I got him. Okay. I probably shouldn't have refilled this thing all stuff. Darn it. Let's actually feel something useful. Looks like I'm gonna want the rush jet again. 
Maybe everything else earlier was a ploy to get me to use it. Okay, this, uh... <laughs> well, to be fair, I, um, didn't have much health left after that last time. I would make a save state like I did on the last level, which I am still not ashamed about. But I did start this level with only one life, so I think if I die and come through here again, it would be much less stressful for me. Oh, shoot. Well, it was good timing, I guess. Lose a life, get a game over, and uh, come back in there with a full rush jet. Alright, stage select. Okay, everyone, here we go. He is actually quite hard, at, to tell the truth, when you have to fight him over and over, and you realize that I got lucky the first time. That's simply all there is to it. I needed to use one of the energy tanks that got my trip back to beat him. So yeah, maybe not quite as much of a pushover as I had expected. Come on, keep going Mega Man. Keep on going Mega Man. I'm probably going to need both of these. This is definitely an endurance test. that. Whew. If you don't know that you can change directions, you are screwed there. And that's it. Yeah. Oh wait, shoot. I needed to... <laughs> okay, that was rather stupid. Oh boy. I'm not supposed to be refilling the coil. Oh wait, shoot, I wanted to use Squirrel there, never mind. Aha, I win. What is a giant met? What am I supposed to be hitting? His eyes? Oh shoot, 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 shoot. So I have to hit him on the top? Let's see, I can't re- Whoa! Let's do a little bit of magnet. What, you're not gonna- Okay, fine. Oh, lucky. Oh, shoot! I am- I need a needle. I don't want that thing to feel wasted. Hey, life! Awesome! I'm a fan of this. What is this thing weak against? I want to know. But I'm not going to find out. I'm not going to take the time to find out. I uh, could use Shadow Blade, but I have to get in a little close for that. Let's just stick with the regular arm cannon. You're supposed to be flying lower, actually. Health! should probably be taking the time to refill some stuff. i get another point for Magnet, just in case. Hard Knuckle... I'll try the Gemini Beam. Point, point, point. Okay, the problem here is I can't hit you. Oh, sure, now you give me one of the big ones. So, does he only come down when I have the regular blaster? Oh, wait, where's his health? Or does this thing have no health and he's just like one of the regular enemies? That would be a problem. Shoot! Uh, okay. Am I just supposed to get lucky here? Oh, shoot. 
I'm almost dead. Oh, there he is! Oh, yeah, that... Yeah, okay. Oh my gosh! Yeah, that was needed. Uh, by the way, sorry about the no commentary earlier, but it has been a real pain to get back here. It's a really good thing that I made a save state right outside of the previous Doc Robot. Because... Okay, I, mean, I have to pause to say this. It's a good thing I made a save state right after the first Doc Robot section because... Uh, you know all those refills for the rush jet that we picked up on our way across the chasm? They don't come back. Yeah, it has been very aggravating to get back here. You have some idea. <laughs> I won't say you have no idea. And this thing is a giant metal, or a giant met. I, yeah, I did look stuff up for it because it was really annoying that I couldn't shoot him. You can only hurt him by hitting that red plus mark on his helmet. And he is weakest to the Mega Buster and the Needle Cannon. It only takes, like, ten shots from each, I think? Oh, wait. Let me double check something here. Ten shots from each? Oh. He's actually weakest to the Hard Knuckle and the Search Snake. And the Gemini Laser just slightly after that, but... Anyway, this seems to be working. I'm not wasting any ammo for it. So I'm just gonna keep using this. Why won't you come down here? That's it, that's it, yeah, 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 okay, yes, okay. Um, save state. <laughs> and carry on. Who's next? I can't believe it, I've actually got, oh wow, that's new. I actually have a half hour of recording time because of that guy. Okay, they can fly down to the floor. I remember you. Oh, I can shoot out the little bubbles they fire. That's unexpected, but okay. Not that I can really have a chance to hurt them, but... You know, whatever. Oh my gosh, another one! <laughs> Not this time. Not this time. What's next? Terrific. Uh, I think I'm gonna try to kill this guy. Okay, or not. Actually, I'm gonna qu do a quick save state. Yes, the Dr. Robot stages are filled with save states. No, I am not ashamed, because after last episode, it's not worth it. Oh, hey, we're there already. Okay, cool. So, okay, the next guy is weakest to hard knuckle and top spin. Based on my previous experiences with top spin, I don't think I'm going to be using it. Instead, let's go to the hard knuckle. Everything's got a really good fill on it at the moment. I'm surprised. Crash Man. Every point of damage I take from this guy will be a 4. Okay. That's it. Ha ha! Got him! And I am not ashamed to say that I used the easiest way to fight that guy. At all. Not ashamed at all. Well, I am in a much better mood than I was last episode, so here's the password if you guys want to join me. I think that the stage was actually harder than Doc Robot this time. So I'll come back next time, and we will fight another Doc Robot section. Again. My gosh. Is he going to be Dr. Ry Wily? I hope that the game is over when I'm done fighting him. Really hope so. Even if it is kind of strange. No, they probably won't do that. Doc Wily has to be the enemy at some point. I wonder if they'll give me an actual story while I play, that would be strange. Anyway, 
Thank you for joining me. See you guys next time. Have a good day.